Hello again, everyone. Welcome back. Well, today we're looking at a new cigar from Black Label Trading Company. It's that time of year when they start bringing out newer cigars. And this one is no stranger to you. It is the Viaticum. But this is a new size. 6x48 Toro is the one I chose to go with today. They uh, also have total of three sizes this year in addition to the normal 5x54 box press Robusto there is also a 6 and 3 fourths by 40 Lancero to go with this 6x48 Toro so a total of three now and uh, the blend should be uh, familiar to you Ecuadorian Maduro wrapper Honduran Habano binder and Nicaraguan and Honduran filler. Uh, first introduced two years ago in the Viaticom is an offshoot of the Last Rites series. So that's sort of the long and the short of it. Let's get right to it. The new Viaticom Toro. Now, all of the sizes are box pressed, and this one is two. There's your density. That's an average feel in the hand. It's not, it's one of the smaller rings, except for the Lancero. This is a 48, so I thought it might be maybe a little different, maybe a little better than the Robusto at 54. We'll find out. Now this little band at the foot simply says Viaticom. Uh, slides right off. Mine are uh, dry enough that it comes right off. Draw is good. We're ready. Well, the chief had to slide into the description. I forgot to put him in the light up. That's on me. But as far as the cigar goes, you get your flavors almost immediately, and they are very pronounced. A nice tangy cedar with citrus, a lot of orange citrus influence. A caramel toffee mix, very sweet. You know, of course, there's a lot of brown sugar in, in those, but we'll call it caramel toffee. A little nutmeg and a generous amount of black coffee. There is quite a bit of black pepper at the light up. You will notice it right away, and it's very nice, very tingly. It's, it's, I would rate it at eight, possibly up as high as eight and a half. It's quite a bit of black pepper. It's a very sweet yet dark noted start. Very nice start. here at the first third doesn't take a long time and the flavors are exactly like I described them at the outset medium to full body we're going to get the full body very quickly I think finish is uh, cedary brown sugar and a little black coffee and a little nutmeg very good lingering black pepper this is a tasty cigar. It's, it's uh, one of James Brown's best, in my opinion, this, this Viaticom. First go around with the Toro, but I'm liking what I see so far. 95 for the first third. Very, very good cigar. So uh, we're, out, we're off to a good start. Let's see what we have in the second third.
end of the second third. Not much has changed. But being hypercritical, it's what I do. The tangy orange citrus is not there, but the cedar is, and the um, caramel slash toffee is nutmeg and quite a bit of black coffee. The black pepper is still up at least around eight. It's fantastic. The finish is pretty much unchanged. Nice, nice lingering black pepper. I say we're at full bodied. The cigar just, again, being hypercritical with that citrus going away, it lost just a tick, just, just a little bit. I'm going to lower it to 94. It's, this is still just fantastic. There's no way you can say this cigar is a good. Uh, it continues to amaze me that James cigars don't end up with, on more top cigars of the year. I don't get it. Those of you who are like me that think he makes really good cigars, you don't get it either. That's okay. Just watch my reviews. The rest of them don't matter. How about that? This is a good, good cigar, and I'm anxious to see how we progress through the final third, but get your, get your checkbooks ready. You're going to want to buy some of these. Down to the end. So let's wrap it up. The citrus nose made a little bit of a resurgence. Definitely got a citrus cedar brown sugar, which is probably from the toffee caramel mix. Nutmegs, not overly abundant, but it's there. And a lot of black coffee. The sweeter notes sort of ticked back up. Full body without a doubt. Finished unchanged. Excellent cigar. Small batch has them in five packs for 76 and a quarter. That's up there, but you can get 10% off using the code R Cigars. R Cigars. 10% off and free shipping. This cigar is just just great. I love the caramel toffee notes. And there's a lot of black coffee, but it's not too much. And the cedar slash citrus, which is predominantly what the cigar is, is an excellent addition. It's a very tasty cigar. Very sweet, very tasty, very full body. Final third, I would go back to 95. Why not? It's that it's, it's, it's improved. It's good. It's great, actually. Overall score, 90, 94.67. I had to look at my notes. I forgot. 94.67. Absolutely excellent. I told you, get your checkbooks ready. Credit cards, go get them. Small Batch has them in all three sizes right now. So there you have it, the new Viaticom 2021 Toro, 94.67.